As an environmental science major, I'm naturally a tree hugger. So imagine my shock when I find out I'm allergic to literally every type of tree and long grass. I love nature, but it doesn't love me. The reason I got tested in the first place was because my mouth suddenly started getting itchy when I ate strawberries. In all fairness, there was a week where I was literally eating nothing but strawberries so I can understand why my body was protesting. Turns out I'm not allergic to strawberries though. The doctor who tested me explained that there's a phenomenon where your body will think that eating raw fruits and veggies is you just straight up eating leaves. Understandably, it'll try to get you to stop. But I'm not eating leaves. So I can't eat bananas and strawberries anymore without my body thinking I'm shoveling leaves into my mouth. While we're on this topic though, I have something really important to ask you guys. Did you ever want to eat tree bark as a kid? It just looks like it would taste good, like some sort of candy bark. I also attempted to drink an entire bottle of soap as a kid, and I ate an entire bottle of Flintstone vitamins, so completely understandable if I'm the odd one out here. Let me know in the comments if there's anything inedible that you really wanted to eat as a kid, because I really want to hear it. Back to leaves though. I live in Canada, which means that I had to draw a lot of maple leaves back in elementary school. Every other country has stripes or circles or stars, but no, Canada had to do like the hardest thing to draw. But I draw for a living now though. So surely, this time I can do it in one try without looking. I can draw a maple leaf.